But all these things look familiar. They think this is what you would tell any 18-year-old or 17-year-old, good job, you're going to be ready to vote soon, you need to have an active voice. This is what we tell our youth. Why aren't we reminding our autistic adults who, again, when the systems of cultural dependency for education, health care, and, and even vocational training fall away at age 18, what stands in that gap? We stand in that gap. I, I want to create a culture where we stop complaining and take more personal responsibility ourselves that we can affect good social change ourselves. Everybody wins. Everybody wins. Black or white, male or female, autistic or not autistic. When everyone makes well-informed votes, we all win. Autism can and should be seen as a legal disability following all current rules and regulations for that to make accommodations that are, are reasonable and still afford them the opportunity to vote. For the first time, individuals with autism can be seen as responsible voters. More importantly, we get to be seen as active citizens who step out from the shadows of disability in adulthood to make well-informed choices not only for them, but for their kids and next generations. Thing to have a cold call to 50 senators and offices. It's another thing to stand with somebody who can affect that change and, you know, who clasps your hands and, and says, you know, we can be better, all of us. Isn't that what politics should kind of be like? That we support each other? That we see government as people, not barriers or obstacles or enemies? That we can find allies in government just by trying to do the right thing. I'm Dave Cott, and I'm an adult with autism. Today I'm asking more people with autism to be seen as active, responsible citizens. And this year, in the primary elections or general elections, please make well-informed votes. Obtain voter registration where needed. Find out where your local polling place is. And when needs be, use an absentee ballot to compensate for a disability so you can be seen, recognized, and heard, even if you yourself may be nonverbal. Your voice is your vote in this election, and we need to exercise that. Please contact your local officials. We have support from every Pennsylvania senator willing to assist their constituents with autism to vote in this election. Please vote. Take responsibility for your life. Be well informed and have a good day.